we're going to start by making a slip knot, forming a loop so we can put our hook through the loop. Then we're going to proceed by chaining 12. We want our work to be 10 stitches across, so we're going to make a chain of 12 because we need 2 stitches for turning. There are different ways you can hold the yarn when you're crocheting. Um, most people don't hold it the way I do, but this is the way I learned. I was self-taught, and you can hold the yarn whatever way is comfortable for you. Okay, we have our chain. Now we're gonna yarn over and we're gonna go into the back loop of the third chain from the hook, pull through, then yarn over and pull through all three loops on the hook. And we're gonna repeat this all the way across and we should have 12 half, I'm sorry, 10 half double crochets at the end. Now after going into the last half double crochet here, we are going to chain two and turn our work. And then for our second row, we will do this again. But we're going to be going in through the, both, both those loops so we'll yarn over, go through both loops, the third stitch from the hook, our chain, and again, yarn over, go through both loops, yarn over, bring through three. We're going to continue this across all the way to the end, and then we'll chain two and turn our work again. And this is how we do our half double crochet. Thank you for learning with me. Happy crocheting.